Hello everybody, I am Mihari of Mabinogi, and welcome to the new Let's Play of Chrono Trigger. As per the usual at the beginning of most of my LPs, a disclaimer that I am going into this game knowing... pretty much jack shit. I played its sequel, Chrono Cross, completely unaware of the fact that it was a sequel to Chrono Trigger, but according to the people that I asked, you can basically go through the entirety of Chrono Cross and be spoiled on next to nothing from Chrono Trigger, other than the fact that, like, there's a thing called Lavos, and a girl called Shala, and that's about it. So, I basically know nothing about the game proper, besides the fact that, well, there's a thingy called Lavos, and time travel is involved. Also, that manga luminary Akira Toriyama did the artwork for this game. I actually remember looking into this game and I'm like, wow, the main character kind of looks like a Dragon Ball character. And that's when Nerva piped up with, oh yeah, didn't you know, hun? The author for Dragon Ball and Dragon Ball Z did the artwork for this. And I just thought that was a neat tidbit. I mean, I knew about Akira Toriyama's work on Dragon Quest, but Either way, I am really looking forward to this game, because this is another one of those games that I missed out on as a kid. Uh, we didn't have a lot- that is a big fucking job. But, uh, we didn't have a lot of money growing up, and I had even more restrictions on games, because Bible-thumping Christian family didn't want their good Christian daughter playing anything that looked too weird or non-Christian. So while others were having their childhoods practically made by this game, I was probably playing Super Mario World or Legend of Zelda Link to the Past for like the 50th time. Either way though, uh, just watching the attract mode for this game, I'm, I'm already pretty excited. So let's go ahead and go back to the title screen real quick. And we will get started. Battle mode, active, or wait? Well, I consider myself decent enough with active time battles. I mean, I was good enough with them in Final Fantasy IX. So, I mean, while being able to choose strategically is nice, I think I can handle the active battle system. So, let's go with that. And we are... Chrono. Enter your name, then push the start button. Okay. I don't know why it's spelt like that, but then again, character limits are often shortened whenever games come over from Japan to the US. So, uh, why can't I... Oh dear, is my start button busted? I think my start button is busted. Hey, come on, I... okay, there we go. Oh, wow. This looks really pretty. Like, I know we're living in the age of, like, high-end, super-realistic graphics, but I can appreciate me some good pixel art. It looks like there's some sort of celebration going on. Ah. <sighs> Chrono. Chrono! Good morning, Chrono! <laughs> Come on, sleepyhead, get up! My mama is, Mom. Ah, Queen's Bell makes such beautiful music. You were so excited about the Millennial Fair that you didn't sleep well, did you? I want you to behave yourself today. I don't know, but like, five more minutes. Let's get moving now. Mmm. Chrono's easier to coax out of bed than I am, and is much more eager to start the day, but either way, let's let's take a poke around our room first. Let's see. Aw, oh, I can't seem to interact with much. Uh, no! Open those curtains back up! It's a beautiful day outside! We're not gonna sit around with the curtains closed like a shut-in. Anything we can take on our desk? No? Hmm? Alright. Ah, <sighs> good morning, Mom. Finally, by the way, that inventor friend of yours... Hmm? Uh, you know. Oh dear, I've forgotten her name. 
her name's Luca, Mom. Oh, that's right, Luca. Don't forget that she invited you to see her new invention. Run along now, and be back before dinner. I will, Mom. Stay safe while I'm out. Uh, wait, kitty? Kitty? Eee, good kitty. Oh, aw, he's following me around. What a good kitty. Uh, actually, can we talk to our mom one more time before we leave? Oh, I almost forgot. Here's your allowance, dear. Have fun at the fair. Aw, 200 gold. Thank you, Mom. Or gold? Gil? I don't know if it's gold or gil because this is a Square Enix game. Either way, bye, kitty. Be good while I'm gone. Okay. So, I'm guessing this is the town. And, like, while we could poke around... Let's be real here, there's a festival going on, and that sounds a lot more appealing. Ooh, I'm liking this festival music, it's very jovial. Whoa, what are they in such a rush to get? Welcome to the Millennial Fair. Have fun! Thank you, I will. Ah, this is nice. Hello. I heard that Luca and her dad have made another crazy invention. Hmm. Hope it doesn't blow up like all the others. Oh. Oh no, I guess they're notorious for that. Ah, uh, hello, small child. This is Lean Square. They say that people who hear Lean's bell will have an interesting and happy life. Huh. That's a nice tradition. Looks like there are some fair vendors here. I wonder if we can buy a souvenir for... Oh. <laughs> Nope, never mind. This is an equipment shop. I don't want to blow, like, half of the money that Mom gave me. Actually, no, she gave me, like, 300. I don't want to blow all the money that she gave me on something that I don't even know I'm gonna need yet. This is just an item shop. That's a shame. I wanted to see if I could, like, maybe pick her up a souvenir or something. Uh, oh, hey, can I talk to these guys now that, like, they're... Stop... Nope? Okay. So what's over here, then? This is the renowned Tent of Horrors. Spend your zero silver points here. Your discretion, uh, parental discretion is advised. Oh dear. I guess that we get silver points through friggin' fair shenanigans. But buy something from milk here at the swordsmith? Uh, sure? Eh. That's a very expensive sword. I live on the continent's beast. Come see me sometime. Huh. Oh, on the pause button. Okay, there we go. Now I can check on her. Now I can check what we have equipped. I was, I would, I just want to make sure we at least like have something to do it to to defend ourselves with, you know, just in case things happen to go to shit. Let's see, yeah, yeah, we have a wood sword, wood sword, high cap, high tunic, and a bandana. All right, what do you have to say? I heard this guy pays big bucks for charms, weapons, pendants, and other rarities. Huh. I'll have to keep that in mind in case I find any shinies. What do you have to say? That's round's winner. Green, ar green Ambler. Guess the winner? Oh, this is a race! Okay. Of... Uh, G.I. Jogger. Why not? Okay, I guess if you just watch the race and oh, I I made a I made a terrible choice. That is a very fast cat. Well, so much for that. But hey, at least from the looks of it, I don't lose any money for picking the wrong uh, runner. So that's good, at least. Ashen's winner, Cadillac. Okay, let's let's see if the cattle win again this round. Yeah. 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 Oh. Oh shit. Okay. And bad decision again. Well, shit. Yeah, I've always been bad at these, been at like prediction games and whatnot. So, eh. 
let's just like not worry about that and, and enjoy the rest of the fair. Hello. What's the big deal? So what if we won a war against a wizard hundreds of years ago? Hey, I will never down I will never turn down the opportunity for carnival fun times. Uh Ah Hey Ah uh, Ow, that hurt. Ah uh, jeez, I'm sorry. Grano. I'm so sorry. Are you okay? Uh oh, my pendant. Uh, are you okay? Oh no, don't tell me I lost it. Uh, it's right over there, miss. Oh no, don't. I guess we gotta pick it up and give it to her then. There we go. Here you go. Oh, thank goodness, my pendant. It has a lot of sentimental value. May I have it back? Yeah, sure, here you go. I came to see the festival. You live in this town, don't you? I feel a little out of place here. Would you mind if I walked around with you for a while? Yeah, sure. The more the merrier. You're a true gentleman. Ah. Uh, oh, by the way, my name is... Uh... Marl? Marley? We'll go with Marley. Uh, Marley. And you're... Chrono? What a nice name! Pleased to meet you. Now lead on! Aw, uh, we have a festival friend. That's nice. So, let's go see what else there is to do. Actually, uh... Huh. She's an archer. I don't know, she just kind of struck me as a thief. Time to talk. I'm just sitting down for my lunch. Okay, you enjoy your lunch. Also, Kitty. Ah. Keep going if you want to demo Luca's row and robot battle trainer. Collect silver points if you win. Huh. I guess this will. I guess that'll be like. Aw, good kitty. But, uh, I guess that'll be like our combat tutorial? They call me Gato. I have metal joints. Beat me up and earn 15 silver points. Oh my god, he even sings. So it's... Okay. Battle time. Uh... Oh, jeez. Okay, yeah. I, I guess I did sign up for this. Ow. It seems like he has some sort of counter ability. I don't know what I can do about that. It's cool that they can move, but... Eh, it doesn't look like we can, though. Too far away to counterattack. Okay, that's good. Oh! Got ten experience points. Okay, cool, we won! Wait, what do tech points do? I lost, you won. Here's fifteen points. Now wasn't that fun? Yeah, that was. I actually got a little bit of the taste for the game's battle system. That's well and good. Ah, <sighs> that was nice, and maybe we can go back to that tent and... Excuse me. Uh, go back to that tent and, uh, spin some of the points. First, let's, like, let's see what's over here. We have 15 silver points. You want to exchange 10 silver points for 50 gold? Uh, no thanks. I want to see what's in that tent first. So I don't think we... Oh! Wait, wrong tent. I think... Luca's device is all set up. She's at the north end of the square. I can do that in a bit. I want, I want to spend my silver points somewhere. I forgot where, though. My memory is... Hot garbage. Was it... Is it this one right here? No, wait. I talked about it for- oh! Ooh! I play these all the time, I'm really good at them. I've never been able to get the bell to ring, but I can get it really, really close. So I wonder if I can just like... Uh... Oh. I guess I'm supposed to be farther away, so like, let's, let's try that again. We don't want to look like a pansy in front of Marley. That's well put one silver point on your card. Ah, uh, the only person I've known who can ever get the bell to ring like that is my stepdad. 
those runners aren't busy re- oh, okay. Okay, it's busy. The kingdom's been through a lot. Like, we led the war against Magus 400 years ago. Thank goodness things are so peaceful now. That sounds like foreshadowing. Is this Magus guy gonna come back and send everything to shit? Okay. Okay, there we go. This is this is the place where we spend it. Is it is it in this part or do we just go in the tent? Hello. Thing. Welcome to Norstein Beckler's lab. The spine tingling show is about to start. Oh boy. How many silver points would you like to pay? Uh, ten. I'm Vix. I'm Wedge. Ha, <laughs> that's a reference. I'm Piet. Okay. I don't understand. Find my- Oh, fuck, I was supposed to be paying attention. Shit. Uh... When in doubt, pick the one in the middle. I'm Wedge. Fuck. Well, that was a waste of ten silver points. I didn't even know I was supposed to be paying attention. Oh, well, let's go, like, poke around the rest of the fair. What's going on over here? It's a sort of guzzling contest. Press the A button as fast as you can. Ready, set, go. Only six cans? Is that the best you can do? Motherfuck. You're awfully competitive, aren't you, Chrono? I want a rematch! Can I- can I not- Can I drop the top to the guy? Okay, there we go. Okay. Ready, set. Ah, damn. It looks like only six cans is the best we can do. Oh well. Hello. Where's my cat? Oh, poor kid. Oh wait, didn't we? Yeah, we saw a cat somewhere. Maybe that cat's hers. And like, it started following us, so maybe we can get us. Okay, yeah, here it is. Hey, kitty, you want to follow me for a little bit? Oh, oh no. Come on, kitty. It's okay. But yeah, maybe this is that girl's cat. Either that or it's like on that other part of the map that we haven't been to yet. Is this your cat, kiddo? You brought back my cat! Thank you! Aw. You're so sweet, Chrono. Ah. Uh, no pet ever deserves to be separated from the owner. So what's over here then? Ooh. Dancing and feasting. A prehistoric dance. How enchanting. Huh. Catchy rhythm. Use the X, Y, L, and R buttons to dance. Oh shit! Okay, Marley, let's boogie down. Yeah. Ah. Uh, looks like they're having a good time. I would not be able to dance here. I, uh, I have two left feet. And that's, that, that's me being generous. Like, I shit you not, the one school dance that I went to, I basically just went because my friends thought it would be fun if I went, and they went off to dance without me. And I just sat back in the corner with the evil kids. Ah. Uh, that was in middle school, though. Either way, though, like, this is really catchy. I'm probably gonna end up listening to this later. Ah, it seems like that's all there is to do, so like... Maybe we should go check out Luca's invention. I hate bears. Say, do you know the latest gossip? Uh, no. Just between us, I heard that the king is distressed over his tomboy of a daughter. But just once, I would like to see how wild she really is. Huh. Anyway. Hold your horses! I wanna get some candy! Oh, alright. Uh, so do I- Give me just a second! Oh, sorry Marley. 
I didn't think that I actually had to, like, sit and wait. Hey, I'd like some of this. Sure, young lady. Thanks for waiting. Yeah, sorry, I didn't mean to seem like I was, like, not listening. I just, you know... Step right on up. Any of you who have the time and the courage, our send our super dimension warp is the invention of the century. To use it, jump here. And you'll get teleported here. It's the masterwork of my beautiful daughter Luca. Aw, it's good that her dad is so supportive. Ah. Uh, hey Luca, we made it. Kono! Where have you been? No one wants to try the telepod. How about you? Ah, sure, why not? It looks like fun! I'll watch here while you try it out! Ah, sure, why not? Just hop into the left pod. Alright. All systems on! Begin energy transfer! Oh, wow! What seems pretty medieval. That was pretty impressive, Luca. Glad I could be the lovely assistant. What a kick! I want to try it too! Huh? Hey, Kono, how'd you pick up a cutie like her? Uh, would you believe me if I said I literally bumped into her? Hang on, Kono, I'll be right there. Behold, ladies and, ge and gentlemen, as this vision of loveliness steps aboard the machine. Don't go away, I'll be right back. You sure about this? There's still time to change your mind. No way! Throw the switch! Okay, everyone, let's give her a great big hand when she reappears. All systems on! Begin energy transfer! Oh no, why did the music suddenly get serious? Why is Marley glowing? What's happening? My pendant! It's... Huh? Uh-oh. Oh... That... Oh. Uh. Luca, where is she? Show's over, folks. Let's head along now. Yeah, damage control. <laughs> Holy shit, what just happened? What's going on, Luca? Where is she? The way she disappeared. It couldn't have been the telepod. The warp field seemed to be affected by her pendant. What are we gonna do now? She's so familiar. I know I've seen her somewhere. Oh, shit. What do we do, Luca? Hmm. Well, if it was affected by her pendant, maybe I could go after her. actually going to do it? What a fine lad. Listen, I don't know where this machine is going to send you, but we haven't any other choice. Won't they both be lost? This is our only hope. That pendant seems to be the key, so hang on to it, Chrono. Embrace yourself. All systems on! Begin energy transfer! Power to full! Roger. More! Give me more power! Roger! There! We did it! Oh boy, here we go. Be back soon, I hope. I'll follow you after I know what went wrong. Good luck, Chrono! 
We'll be back as soon as we can, I guess. Ooh. Ooh, that's trippy. Reminds me of an Earthbound battle background. Oof. Where are we? Well, I guess we'll have to find out by just- Oh! Uh-oh. What are those? Little blue men that screech like velociraptors! And we all have to fight them. Ow. Oh, they certainly hurt less than the robot. Which is nice. I still wish, like, is... Uh, since I'm new to this whole thing, feel free to just, like, let me know in the comments. Is there a way that I can change my own position in battle since enemies move around? Also, what are tech points? What do those do? Anyway, uh, is it like AP? Do I just like use them to like get abilities? No? Hmm. So yeah, just like let me know what they are in the comments. I am. It's gonna take some getting used to for this menu. Oh, right. We should probably. Why can't we save? Are there save points? Is is that a thing? Again, feel free to yell at me about that in the comments. So what was that? Oh god! Birds! And they're carrying little blue men! That we have to fight. Go away. I'm busy. Ow. I said... Go away! I'm busy! Two checkpoints. Make the gold. And Chrono leveled up! Cool! Reno learn Cyclone. Okay, cool. So what's over here? Got one tonic. Okay, that's probably a healing item that we're gonna need later. And a power glove. Is that like an accessory? Let's see what that does. Uh, ooh! Yeah, I'll take that. The harder we can hit, the better right now. Uh... Let's go see, like, it looks like there was another passageway back at the starting point. Let's go see what's over there before we, like, do anything involving those two. Okay, Chrono won't go that way, so I guess there's nowhere to go besides past those two. Oh, shit, we gotta do this again? Okay. I'll save the new cyclone technique for, uh, if we have to fight those three down there. I'm pretty sure there were three of them. Okay, no, from the- okay, wait, we should probably heal up. We didn't heal up from the fair, and those guys had a number on us. Okay, yeah, there's only two of them. Neat. I wonder if we can just, like, They're not attacking. Can we talk with them? Nope, nope. Oh! Oh, there are three of them. I have to fight their ball. Okay, let's, let's, let's try this out. Let's try this. Okay. Okay, that's cool. And that just gets rid of all of them. Neat. Okay. Huh. <sighs> I'm liking this combat system. I kind of wish that I knew the nuances a little bit better, but then again, we are just starting out, and... I know this song! Then again, a lot of people know this song, but just... This is like the one song I know from Chrono Trigger. This is nice. This is... This is... This is our hometown. What? Well, then again, they did say that time travel is involved, so... The window shoppers, what do you want? Uh... Okay, we can buy stuff from Marley, too, that's nice, but, uh... Honestly, with all the beatings we've been taking, we should buy that karate key. Or bronze... no, karate key. 
And some healing items. Those never really go on this. And, hmm, should I? No, I, hmm. Yeah, I'll buy one for me and one for Marley once we, once we reunite. We seem to do good enough damage with our wooden blade. You're gonna fight the man in Magus' army? Wonderful, but be sure to equip yourself with weapons before you buy. Oh, jeez, we got so, f we got flung so far into the past that the Magus' war hasn't even been won yet. Good grief. Either way, let's let, let's put on our new stuff. There we go. Nothing else to inspect around here. Alright. Well, if you ever need information, you go to an inn or a tavern, and this place seems to be both. Where am I? Are you stupid? This is the Kingdom of Guardia. We and when we're battling Magus' army. Hmm. You did know that, right? Sure. By the way, have you seen a blonde girl with a ponytail around here. Money will fair? What? You crazy? What nonsense? Alright. I guess everybody... What a relief. They found Queen Lean wandering up in the mountains. She must be glad to be home. It doesn't sound good. The mountains are where, where, are where we just came from. You're a stranger here too? I'm Toma, the explorer. If you're buying, I'll tell you a story. How about it? Uh, sure. Cider, please. Probably just beer, but... Thanks. It's all about the missing queen. She disappeared while visiting a kind of cathedral in the west, and... I beg your pardon? What? They found her! Never mind. But yeah, if Marley showed up the same place we did... Magus' army destroyed Xenon Bridge, so the south continent is inaccessible. That bites. Uh, also... Uh, I wonder if I can, like, save here? Also, we should probably rest. Wait, ten gold. Aw, oh, that's a pleasant little rest and jingle. Ah. Oh, what's this box next to our bed? This box has been in the family for generations. Open it and you may have what's inside. But it's sealed by a mysterious force. Fuck. But yeah, if Marley showed up in the same place that we did, and we just came from the mountains, I think I know where we need to go next. But first, let's poke around a little bit. I'm Banton, the blacksmith. I'm forging a bell for the king to present to his beloved Queen Lean. I lost it when the queen disappeared. I just couldn't keep working on the bell. But now that it's been, now, but now it's back to business as usual. Huh. We get to, we get to see Lean's bell being forged. That's neat. My husband wants a daughter who's as intelligent as she is beautiful. Huh. Okay. That's neat. But yeah, I, I think I know where our first order of business is. We need to find ourselves a castle. And that looks pretty castle-ish. Then again, what's up here? Like a... Actually... Uh, I should... I forgot. I need to see if I can, like, save here. Is there a save point, or can I just, like, save whenever I'm in a building? Oh, boy. So, yeah, feel free to, like, yell at me in the comments. Either way, uh... What is that? I can't tell. Uh, it's already getting late in the episode, so we should just, like, check out the castle over here and see... Oh, that's a cathedral. I guess since the queen went missing here, we should ask the nuns what they know. Have you seen the missing queen, sister? Oh dear, it looks like you could use some food and a place to rest. Why did you pause before you said rest? You might like to stick around for the organ recital. It's a real killer. That makes me uneasy. People wouldn't know what to do with themselves in a truly peaceful world. My, what delicious... Uh, 
I mean, delightful looking humans. I'm gonna leave. Let, 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 let's go. I think I know what happened to the queen. So... Oh wait, that's the castle up there. I'm a dummy. I'm, I'm a big old dumbo. Alright, but this looks like an upcoming dungeon, probably, so it would be best if we leave the episode off here. I kind of made this one a long end anyway because of all the time we spent to prepare. So, we will go to the castle in search of Marley next time on Let's Play Chrono Trigger. I will see you guys then, and take care. Thanks for sticking around till the end. If you like what you saw, please consider leaving a like, a comment, or maybe even subscribing. If you want to see more of my content, there are some recommendations for you on screen right now. See you soon!